I'm Anne McMillan, and this is the Montessori Trinomial Cube. When you open up the Trinomial Cube and take it apart with a child, the first cube you'll be taking out is the little yellow one. But as the child puts the Trinomial Cube back together, the first cube they'll be putting in is the one at the very back, at the very bottom, the big red one. So, for all intents and purposes, when you're putting this together with children, this one would really be the first one, or maybe A cubed. But since with small children you're not using variables anyway, we would just call this one red cubed. When building the first layer of the cube, children begin with the red cubed, and then find the other prisms that are all the same height as the red cubed, matching black to black, blue to blue, and yellow to yellow. And once that first layer is completed on the map, then the children transfer it into the box. The second layer that children build begins with blue cubed. Children begin by putting the blue cube on the map and then finding all of the other prisms that are the same height as the blue cubed. And when the second layer is complete, the children transfer it into the box. And the third layer, as you would guess, begins with yellow cubed. The same thing happens. Children put the yellow cube onto the map and then find the other prisms that are the same height as the yellow cube and assemble them on the map, making sure that yellow touches yellow, black touches black, blue touches blue, and red touches red. And then, when the third layer is assembled on the map, the children transfer the third layer back into the box. And then, they're done with the trinomial cube. 